everyone, so second video review for this week is for Strange Attractors by Anna K. Wren. Um, if you want to check out my review, I have just posted that, so if you're on YouTube, there's a link in the description below, and if you're on Facebook or on my blog, then there's a link within the post. And this is the video review, so Strange Attractors by Anna K. Wren. Super intriguing and absolutely fantastic. Um, Sonia, who is a professor with very big ambitions, um, they're just within her grasp, and she finds life starts to really throw things into chaos which is just you know so relatable this always happens doesn't it you just think you're getting what you need and then life just throws your curveball because it's just mean like that um so it's like almost as if it was trying to teach her a valuable lesson and then she meets crystal who's a junior professor and it really unsettles everything um but that's not all sonia also appears to be dealing with some past demons um and one hell of a mystery as well so you know i'm really feeling for sonia right now like wow what a story to get yourself wrapped up in. Um, everything about this was weird and wonderful, immediately capturing my imagination and making me super inquisitive. Like I just couldn't figure it out and I just needed to. Um, both Sonia and Crystal, really fascinating people. And um, to be on this adventure with them was something else. I questioned absolutely everything, including them as characters. Um, and that's what Sonia was doing. There were moments where I was as unsettled as Sonia was. I was really like, this is so weird. And then there was others where I was like, yeah, it's easy to understand why she felt like she was coming out of her mind. This stuff was crazy. And um, it was just like, wow. And then there were other moments where I was just really concerned for Sonia. But I just didn't know what was going to happen. So I just, I could only be concerned for her and then just hope she was going to be okay. It was like, yes. I just couldn't have predicted anything in the story. It's so uncertain. Um, that it's really intense and it really draws you in. I enjoyed every moment of it, even though it was a roller coaster. Um, it had ups, downs, loops, moments that stalled, you know, those bits where you get to the top and it like hangs you in the air and you're like hanging upside down wondering if you're going to fall out of the thing, you know, like that. It was like, ah! And then, you know, I just wondered what was going to happen. All, this, all these adrenaline filled moments and it was just so intense. But Sonia was on edge throughout the story and I felt that with every chapter, like so much. I was like, Ugh. Like, you could really feel the tension building. And um, I, because of that, I really struggled to put the book down because you just have this um, this this need. It's just, like, you have to know. Like, you can't leave it on a chapter ending. You're just like, I can't leave it like that. Like, everything was like, I can't, I, I, I don't know what's happening. I need to find out. So you just couldn't put it down. And um, I just needed answers. But there was so much happening it was proper chaos like the theory that Sonia taught which is chaos theory and it was just like <gasps> it almost seemed that everything had a really logical explanation as well but did it like you really think you can apply logic to everything but can't can you like and I understood like why she was and she was she was just uh, questioning everything and it was translated right through to me as the reader and completely unprepared along for the ride whatever happened to Sonia here because just wasn't getting anything else to know um so yeah it was crazy in that respect but it was really good it's really exciting not to have those snippets and not to really understand to be questioning everything you're really then in Sonia's shoes and experiencing like this uh you know like like she did and it really gave Anna a chance to explore the vulnerabilities of such a complex personality and mind that she'd given to Sonia as a character. So that also was really fascinating. Sonia's a really smart person and yet she's driving herself crazy over things that should have a logical explanation. Probably do have a logical explanation, but in that moment just don't have a logical explanation. It's crazy. And I just loved every moment of it. Um, each piece of this started to unravel and then questions became answered slowly and I was so happy that Sonia had the chance to experience love with Crystal and to trust someone and finally have something she'd not had before as well. Um, it really strengthened their connection, um, everything that was happening to her. So a brilliant story. The first time I've read anything by Anna K. Wren and certainly not the last. I was really into this and really enjoyed every minute. So I hope you will too. Um, I'll pop a link in the description uh, so you can go and grab a copy of Strange Attractors by Anna K. Wren, which I really, really hope you will. If you've read Strange Attractors, uh, it would be great to um, know what you thought of it and how you found the experience so please do comment and share below um, if you haven't read it yet but it's on your 
to be read list, you're planning to read it, or you're now super intrigued and thinking, I have to read that book. Um, again, please share because it's always great to know what you are interested in reading. And if you do read it, um, even though it's really, really intense, I hope you have a great time reading it. Bye.